Hello YouTube, Stanley Passion. Jealous Man. I have never figured myself a jealous man. Maybe when I was much younger. During my teen years, I had a bit of a streak. And later toward the end of my drinking life, elements of my character became magnified. True, especially for the worst parts. Liquor always brought me to morbidity. I became lost, crazy, think was upside down. My bending of the elbow grew to obsession. That was the mode, coloring my every move. But you know the story, honey. Hallelujah, I was saved. For me, like St. Paul's miraculous, miraculous conversion, blinded by the light, I had been born free, citizen, Roman, holding rank, armed upon steed, death squad commander, who served at the pleasure of God, Caesar, to whom I had pinched incense and swore allegiance, knowing to act otherwise would mean pain of exile, to be banished from Rome forever. What a story. Not for my horse, and when the saint rose up, up from the ground, from the road outside Damascus, he, he, he had not only raised himself, but us up too, making for us all seats together, heavenly places in the Church of Christ Jesus. Forgive me, I digress, and what I call miracle may, in my case, be exaggeration for a more pedestrian, everyday experience. I felt a panic attack, seizure, or was it uh, alcoholic psychosis? Simply put, I went nuts. Liebchen. Ich bin ganz verrückt geworden. However, the therapies label it. It, it certainly stopped my practice of daily imbibing and freed me from the terrible habit and set me on steps towards character improvement. Yet here, once more, although you know my count, the score of years during which I labored, made every effort to set myself aright. Thanks. Sure, I no longer succumb to the bottles of lure. Still, my mind hosts that awful, that other awful zealotry. Whenever I think about you, dear, the green-eyed monster, despoils me. It eats me alive. When your stockings lay in our bedroom bureau, when you live with me here in our home, I would open the drawer and look upon them. The pang, I would feel lay in what I could not. For unlike them, I could not caress your entire leg. Then I grew jealous of your buttons and zippers. You might say, using strongest intonation, Stanley, how can you be jealous of innocent items? How can you be jealous of objects? Please, things of my own buttons and zippers. But I must retort, not so innocent at all, for they hold you in many intimate places and stay with you the whole day long, even now. Now when you are gone, utterly absent from my side. The devil possesses me, for my arch is so extreme, I have become jealous of your shoes. Because, and here you must have guessed the reason, they hold your feet and take you away from me.